Hey guys, it's Erica. We're going to be checking out Edmix's Dice Dance Practice. Really excited to be checking this out. The choreography was looking nice in the music video. And I really, really love the choreography. I think it's really dope that we got to see for OO and Tank. Um, so now we're getting a little bit more of that, seeing a little bit more of what they can serve us for choreography, understand their style a little bit more. And I, th I think that's also what's very interesting about how they have their sound be so different and like, you know what I mean? And it's constantly changing. Like, um, it, most groups for choreography have like a specific style. So, you know, and again, and sometimes it takes like two or three comebacks to like fully recognize or fully like refine it and get it down. Um, so yeah, we're just, we're just, we're just getting through it. Even though a lot of debuts these days are really, really strong. Some groups, most groups, all groups still like, I think need that like two or three comebacks to really just like figure out what the group is you know what i mean it's a thing it's a thing anyways what am i talking about we're gonna be checking out this choreography today so you know what it let go that intro is crazy nice clean and sharp. Ooh, that was nice though. The little like can placements out. And into that V formation was really nice. Nice. Good lines. Nice. 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 There's the light level change there. It was really nice. 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 They're, they're very clean. Their lines are very good. Nice. Nice. They're, they're so clean, and I think that's what, like... Nice. When you see, like, really clean lines like that, it's so impressive and really shows their skills as dancers, which... Non-dancers are not gonna notice. Hairography, though. And I think when you have so much like kind of like roll offs and ripples and different types of pickups like they do in this choreography, it gets a lot more complicated when. Oh, that's a cool ending pose. When you have a lot of people doing it, because then the timing is so specific. And, you know, K pop groups are so well trained these days, you're just like, they mess up. What? I'm just kidding. Um, no, performance is 100%. But, like, when you have those, it adds so much complexity to those, especially the amount that they have in this choreography. Like, it's probably the most I've seen in a, in a hot second. But, um, it was, it's really good choreography. I think it works for the song. Um, the, it works for like the builds up and the dance breaks that they have. Um, Cause you have like the one in the second verse and then you have one in kind of like the bridge, which I guess that'd be like the true dance break. That part's really well choreographed. They're very clean. Their lines are so clean. They are so, so clean. Like that's probably, I don't know, maybe the cleanest lines I've seen in a hot second or like in a while, I feel like. Um, so, yeah, which it looks, it just looks gorgeous, you know what I mean? And it lo it looks so much cleaner when you do have lines, and that's how you can kind of tell, um, w one of the easy ways to tell, um, like, th how long somebody's been dancing or non dancers apart is their lines. Like, how clean are their lines and their angles and their placements of that? I'm not even good at that. 
messy, but like, it's not my spot. But I don't consider myself like a dancer dancer. Um, just, I just, I be knowing things. I've, I've studied a lot, but in practicality, reality, I haven't like performed a lot. Um, but it's something I've always had like an interest in, but not always the means to, um, practice it or like do it you know what I mean um so like my lines are like horrible so like hands are a good one and it's like sometimes you want like the straightest hands ever and my hands are just so like ugh, they're not pretty either um so it's like sometimes when like I you like you don't want that to happen like for example um so like you don't want any bends in the hands you want it just like straight and you want the thumb like tucked nicely and stuff and then see like even so it's 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 hard it's tough training and stuff and it hurts your hands too as well um so seeing lines like this in this choreography is really great because i mean you only really look for lines like that if it's like um uh, a tutting or like a voguing type of choreography well well vo well depends i guess on what the, the the like more type of voguing movement is but the, voguing is about like those clean lines and stuff like that um as well as like tutting so um but yeah, I guess so. With, those are like the parts where you would like recognize it, where the dance is all about. But when you have choreography like this, where it's not like the main focus of that, and they are showing those lines and those angles, and they're just so clean and so well defined, it's really impressive. That's what I think stood out to me the most here. I feel like what their debut was was to showcase what they can do, like literally everything. And here this feels a lot more um, toned down, which I think was smart. And I think like having a little bit more toned down moments, I feel like a regular choreography, like when the beginning of the song makes those dance break moments like hit that much harder because it's like, it's like, oh, they're just dancing or whatever. And then it goes like, boom, hard impact dance break. You know what I mean? I think it's well choreographed because of that. Um, but I really liked it. I think it's solid. I think it's great. So yeah, go to Pure Thoughts to comment below. We'll talk about NMIX's Dice Dance Practice. So if you liked this video, give this video a thumbs up. If you liked me and you want to see more of my videos, go and hit that subscribe button. If you want to see my videos the second they come out, hit that notification button. If you want to follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, or description down below. At the end screen, share this video to your friends. Thank you guys so much for watching. Love you and I'll tell you guys later. Bye.